Hey guys, so I know there were a lot of you uh, wondering about how I warm up my aim after my uh, gameplay videos. You guys were asking how I have the aim I do. So today I'm just going to make a quick short video to show you what I do. So you can already see that I'm here in Tea House. Tea House? Tea Hunt on House. And the first kind of uh, practice I do is making two holes like this and just flicking to the other one. Simple. So that's kind of how you learn your flicks. Obviously you can uh, learn your trucking by doing this too. So just make one hole and just slowly move, or well not move, but just, you know, and then just go left, keep your aim right on it. Go right, keep your aim right on it. Obviously this car might get in the way. Honestly, this one might be better to do it here. But that you can learn your trucking if you play high sense. Obviously my trucking won't be the smoothest since I do play high sense, but I play high sense for the nice flicks. And you can tell that you're missing because it's gonna break and the bullets, look. If you don't miss, your bullets are gonna go in and it won't cause destruction. So me, I obviously have some practice to do. The second thing which uh, is kind of slept on is obviously your positioning in your chair, how you kind of sit down. It might sound weird, but if you like sit in a certain posture in your chair, you kind of want to sit in that way every single day. Or if you lean over a certain amount on your monitor and then you want to do that every day so it's kind of just the same thing every day if your keyboard's in a certain angle if your mouse is a certain area or if your monitor's a certain angle make sure everything is the same every day just so you're kind of used to it and so on so on this third thing is awareness now this is a very slept on thing as well is awareness so let's say there's an enemy up here and i'm focusing on an enemy in this corner so these terrorists don't screw me up so i'm focusing on this enemy right here in the corner but there's an enemy up here so i know i don't have that monitor where you can see where my eyes are looking but right now i'm looking up here why you also looking here as well like i know it's hard to explain how your eyes kind of you know when you kind of look at two areas at once but you're still looking straight forward you kind of want to do that and then if you do see an enemy maybe vault that and then you kind of just have the instinct to flick up and get that kill easy or if you run into a building oh you see one enemy but you kind of see like all right just maybe in the leg of an enemy your brain will slowly develop i guess the only way to improve this is just to play but your brain will slowly develop a thing where like you see a leg pop out and you're focusing on an enemy here and then like you just kind of flick up so awareness is a thing maybe you can go online to i don't know find tests for awareness but i think honestly the best thing to do is to play the game i know that's kind of a hard way of putting it or maybe not the best way to put it but awareness is just a thing but i guess the overall f best thing to do is to play ash and literally run in don't stop sprinting the enemies are obviously going to shoot you back so before they shoot you back you need to be quick this is a good thing about t hunt they shoot you back so you learn to be quick you know to quickly okay i'm trash my bullets aren't hitting but like you learn to like before they all shoot me which is another point, not being in the zone. If you're not in the zone to play, it's not gonna work. You kinda you kinda need that hype. Maybe play some music when you play T Hunt and like, you know, if it builds up, you know, you kinda feel like you're on a jam jam. You see, I'm kinda talking and making a video, so I'm not so focused. So make sure you're focused in a game, you're really, you know, kinda intense on it. If I even I don't know, that this kinda sounded weird. But look, so I'm not going to talk. I'm literally going to just try hard focus on killing people. And let's see the difference I have now. Yep. 
you can see instantly the difference when you're just so focused. And never mind, I'm just trash. Okay, I quit. I'm trash. Okay, is this video even worthless? I'm trash. I'm kidding. These tips are still viable. So, your posture on your chair sounds weird, but trust me, it's important. Make sure it's the same all the time. I guess find a sense that you're comfortable with. If it's too fast, slow it down. If it's too slow, make it fast. I don't even think I mentioned that, but that's important. Finding a sense you're comfortable with. The other thing I said was like making the holes in the garage and flicking to each other to learn the flicks and then making one hole and moving left and right to practice the trucking and then I think the most important one is the awareness you know knowing your surroundings and seeing an enemy like here on your monitor and then adjusting it using the you know power to the mouse to know oh okay he's here on the monitor so that means my arm and my hand on the mouse needs to do this movement for my aim to get there on the monitor. It's very confusing, but honestly, playing the game just makes it better. So that's just a guide on my personal way of improving aim. I'm not expecting this video to get that many views because it's, I don't expect it to get views. It's just for the people who are wondering what I do for my aim and if you're inspired by my aim, which is crazy to think, but yeah, this is just what I do to practice my aim and just kind of little tips. So I hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope you all have a wonderful day and goodbye.